What's up, YouTube? It's your boy TJ and your girl Crystal, and we are back again with another banger. Today is about to go down, y'all, because today we're going to we got another MGK reaction. MGK. Yes. We're going to be reacting to Machine Gun Kelly. Machine Gun Kelly. The return. The return. The return. With lyrics. With lyrics, you know what I'm saying? So I'm ready to go ahead and jump into it and see what he got. Let's go. Let go. And they say no me. Fuck out of All you got knows what I've been through, man. So if you want to talk, get your facts straight first. And if you really want to know, let me ask you something. Have you ever walked in the shoes of a giant or had to fill the position of a boss before you were even the client? It's no wonder, bro. He said, This is right here. Have you ever, uh, I don't know, but he said something about have you ever put your shoes in the Just foot of a it. boss before you even had a client? Yeah. That's deep. Giant. That's like knowing you a boss without being a boss. Had to fill yeah. the position of a boss before you were even a client. Oh, okay. Well, yeah, I feel it. <laughs> I had to fill the position of a boss before you were even the client. It's no wonder growing up under the rules of a tyrant that that would be the poster boy for defiance. Now I'm the voice of the silence. Fuck being quiet. I've seen 20 years worth of violence. I'm tired. It's a burden for me to open my eyes. Not an undercover cop, but it's safe to say that I'm wired. I can't even get a grip on my life appliance. I'm fucked up in that head. Close my eyes because I see demons by my bed. So depressed, open them up, hoping I'm dead. Fuck the fame and make it better, but it don't mean fuck me over. Never used to touch a bottle, now I'm hardly ever sober. Damn. Hardly ever sober. Never used to touch a bottle, bottle. but now he's hardly ever sober. Damn. Because of the fame. The fame. And that shit gets to him and he feel like, because that's not him, you know what I'm saying? So, having to get in the zone to be something, put yourself in front of people like that. Imagine that, going outside and like, it ain't just a normal walk to the car. It's like, oh shit. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Constantly. It's like constantly going to the grocery store. You know what I'm saying? Like, oh shit. <laughs> yeah. You better, but it don't mean fuck me over. Never used to touch a bottle, now I'm hardly ever sober. People wanna be my friend, but where the fuck were y'all when I was 10? I'm loving the 12, getting bullied and beat up in the gym. I couldn't never get a girl, now all of a sudden I'm the man. Damn. Students try to get back home with me. And he said he never get a girl now, all of a sudden he's the man. Yeah, everybody wanna be his friends now, but when he was 10, 10, 11, 12, Getting bullied, no, but no girl wanted to be with him. None of that stuff. That's a big change. Man, you know what dope. I mean? Yeah. That's a huge change of your mental. Mm -hmm. You know. Now I gotta say this. I guarantee you, after he became a man, he fucking abused that. You know what I'm saying? Abused that situation because he had to make up for all that lost time. You know he what I'm probably had. And then, because when he was in... And then in, that probably fucks with him. And yeah. And that's probably a reason why he was drinking. You because, know. look, his first relationship probably became... Plug the Mac up. Or a real relationship. Oh, hell. Well, it's like he's making up for all that lost time. Mm -hmm. And at the time he became famous, he probably just got in a relationship. You know what I'm saying? So that girl has to deal with all that making up. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? And that's just... And that girl probably went through a lot of bullshit while he was making up. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? So. Yeah, fuck them all. Cause guess Schizophrenic cousin tried to end his life while he was sleeping. Damn. Whoa. Whoa. Schizophrenia is no joke. Yeah, it that's ain't. that. It ain't. Yeah. That's that type of mental disorder that make people have hallucinations and stuff. You can't do nothing about that. You know what I'm saying? You can't. That this is deep. It's real deep, y'all. Yeah. Uh, MGK went through some shit. MGK, bro, salute to you. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Because I used to deal with uh, social security disability. 
as far as working for a law office. You know what I'm saying? Oh, people with social security disabilities. Yeah, and so a you lot never of, had a social security. No, no, no. I worked for a law office that did. Yeah. And a lot of those people who got approved for their social security disability had schizophrenia. Yeah. Like fucking bipolar was a big one. You know what I'm saying? All that little shit. Especially if you got bipolar and schizo together. Yes. Jesus. And there's one more. I think that's just anxiety. Yeah. Yeah. I've got anxiety. Anxiety. Yeah. Oh, panic attacks. Yeah. Panic attacks, anxiety yeah, attacks. It's anxiety. two different things. Yeah, but it, it panic attacks. Fucking that, that that hits hard on social security disability. Before a teacher lost my dad in the preaching. Half my friends are buried six feet on the rest in the precinct. Literally watched my grandmother die from diabetes. I guess my prayers were answered, but my heart got canceled and beat it. No one wanna get her out of job. Give her the guard and the beat it. I did a lot of bad shit. God got even, but for the price I had to pay, I wish I'd stop breathing. He said he did a lot of stuff. God stopped breathing for the price he had. To, I mean, God. <laughs> I'll try to get to the, the other bar real quick. God got even. God got even. And then he stopped breathing or something. Okay. Yeah, but back yeah, to you it. Can yeah. Write that all up. Yeah. That shit got got even, but for the price I had to pay, I wish I'd stop breathing. My girl sat in the bathtub, eight hours bleeding, hearing the doctor tell us our child's heart stopped beating. Fuck a million. I wouldn't take a dollar for a life, but I don't do what's in my heart and trade this dollar for a mic. I wrote the song in hopes that it could help someone get through the night, but no intentions of getting paid. I'm just doing what is right. I do it for the fans. He said he ain't doing it with no intentions of getting paid. He's just doing for what's right. You know what I'm saying? He does it for the fans, like the yeah. real, actual fans that stick with him through everything. Right. Now, I got to say this. Being an artist and even doing YouTube videos, of course, there's stuff you do for money, right? But throughout a day, there's always something that you do just to help. You know what I'm saying? Like we if we do six, seven videos, one of those videos at least was new, was something that we felt should go out there. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? No no money, no view, no no none of that is even accounted for with that video. It's just something that we wanted to do. And if it hits, good thing. If if it helps, good thing. Yeah. But that's real, man. You know what I'm saying? At least one time a day, at least do something not think about yourself. Yeah. And thinking about something. I mean, not even thinking, I mean, really outside your family, How too. How you're going to benefit from it. Yeah, yeah, without Just thinking do about it. something you want to do because you want to do it. Yeah, 100%. You stuck with me through the storm because they understand that there's a genuine pain behind the words I'm saying, and they embrace me. So I thank y'all for staying. Ain't it crazy? The passion is my Achilles heel. Either that or keeping it way too real, but they don't know how it feels. To feed off the energy of the crowd, step on stage and make it loud. Dad, I'm gonna make you proud. I know we don't speak right now, but I think turning new leads what we need right now. I love you, and you may not see right now, but I'm begging for. Forgiveness. I'm on my knees right now. You saw your son as a truck out, stuck around in a van. Saw your son as a felon. Now see your son as a man. See your son be a father. To you said see your son as a felon. Now see your you seen your son as a felon. Now see your son as a man. Yeah. Man, that's some real shit, man. Hell, for your mother or father. You know what I'm saying? But that's why I want. I'm glad Mama got to see me. My life changed. Yeah. To the point to where she damn near almost forgot the whole part of my first life, or mm -hmm. unless she uh, uh, chooses not to, not to think of, look at, and judge me based off of that. You know what I'm saying? To her, that that almost didn't happen. Yeah, I know a few people you know that always said they never thought you would be where you're at today. Yeah. But, but yeah, but I'm talking about even mama, you know what I mean? Because mama was there. She used to tell me all the time, stay out there, I don't want you, and cry to me, I don't want you out there, and stuff like that. And now for her to, you know what I mean, not even look at that way or mm -hmm. refuse to even go back, I fuck with that. Yeah. I'm trying to be the same way, but I'm glad I'm, I'm, I'm this way, though. I'm glad I know both lives and I know what to strive for. You know what I'm saying? Because you can't be stuck in one box just forever. You can't just want to be in that box you can't you know what i'm saying you got to run and proceed because that bus is like a mouse 
stuck in, in a box. The motherfucker just gonna be running around, running around till you know that motherfucker like to bang his hand. And then you're gonna be somebody like one of these motherfuckers we know yeah. who, got, who got stories for days. Oh, yeah, that's my cousin. That's the people I know. You know yeah. what I mean? And damn, you know the whole whole city. But don't know any place outside of it. Beautiful child, just see a sun dance, see me smile. Who would have thought it started at the bottom with some day crow? I'm three people in the crowd, unpaid shows. Six people oh. in the room, one meal a day. Another opening act when no one knows my name. So the demos that I passed out laying on the crowd. So the rappers have a friend and copy of my style. So opportunities pass while these fakes got rich. No, I can't stop speeding like my brakes ain't shit for six months. I would have always talked about earlier when he said some rappers he know now copying his style. I don't know. Damn, listen. I befriended copy. Saw the rappers I befriended copying my style. Yeah, my style. So opportunities pass while these fakes got rich. No, I can't stop speeding like my brakes ain't shit. For six months I went through hell and back. Right at the height of my success, all of a sudden doctor said I couldn't. But I had a problem from my vocal cords. Left with a choice. Stop now or possibly lose my voice. But I woke up every morning and recorded till my throat swore shut. Talk blood up the rappy show because it hurt that much. I went weak. No help, Damn. Dr. Bill's power. How, how long he say he was in there? Uh, like, I think some about six months. He had a polyp on his vocal cord. A, what is a polyp? It's like a tumorous like thing. Like cancerous, tumorous bone. Damn. And he was... He wasn't supposed to rap no more. And he still did it and was bleeding when he was rapping. Like... Blood coming out of his mouth, coughing and stuff. He just kept doing it though. And he was rapping. Fast. And he's still here, shit. His yeah. voice is still here, you know yeah. what I mean? Yeah. For my daughter and my fam, and every single fan I push through it, now I'm back for y'all again. As for my competition, it's the beginning of the end. But right now, this is my return. Amen. Hell. <laughs> Salute to Kells, man. Damn. I, I ranked this a 10. That was a super deep song. Real deep. Super deep. Yeah, I, I give that a 10. That's a motivation song, too. It's a real page out of his diary. I fuck with it. You did. Yeah. Yeah. But that was our reaction to the video. Yo. Go ahead and comment your reaction down below once you get this video between 1 and 10. Put a fire emoji if it was hot. Trash emoji if it was not. But definitely comment down below. Also, if you want another MGK reaction, how many likes should this video get? 52. 52 likes. We'll do another MGK reaction. But it has to get 52 likes. The only way it's going to get 52 likes is if you like, comment, subscribe, and share, share, share. All on social network. Anything else, babe? That's all I got. That's all she got. That's all we got. We got this thing. Peace. <laughs>